Hey everybody, it's Jen from a and Suds and Such. And this is my strawberry shortcake I made yesterday. And I did the making video and I'm trying to get it uploaded. I'm not sure, <clears throat> excuse me, if it's going to upload or not. Um, I worked on it for all day yesterday trying to get it to upload. And it failed twice because it's a 48 minute video. Because I did it from start to finish. So I'm not sure if I'm going to get it. But I figured I would let you guys see me unmold this, see how it does, see how it turned out with that mat. Because I have no idea. This is the first time I've used a fondant mat. And I'm hoping that it is gorgeous. Okay. I'll turn this so you guys can see. goodness not sure if you guys yeah I think you can see that that is beautiful oh I'm totally stoked right now yeah I have no idea that worked like a charm it's all I've got to say that is just beautiful. Just so you guys know, that is a fondant mat, and you can see how flexible it is. I ordered mine off of Amazon, and it was 20 by 20, so this has been cut up. Worked awesome. Let me bring this closer, get this out of the way. Just look at the bottom of that soap and the side. Is that not just beautiful? Oh, okay. Now that I know it works, oh crap, oh, that's heavy. Now I'm hoping that I don't scuff it up. We'll see. Let's tighten this up. Okay, need a paper towel. I'm just super happy <laughs> with how this turned out. Oh, it's just so pretty. Okay, let's get this in. Let's see if I didn't get these cut straight. Oh, I'm not even making sure you guys are in the video. Let's see. Is that in there good? Hope so. Alright. This is my first soap. Isn't that pretty? And see, oh I just love it. It just it gives it just that extra something. There's my heart on top. And of course it smells gorgeous. Um, I can't remember which soaping group it was on that they were using these and I was like I have got to try that because their soaps were just so pretty. And look at that. Oh wow, look at that swirl. I'm just in love with how that turns out. I know, I'm sorry. I'm like a kid in a candy store. These will need cleaning up, obviously.
There's this. Beautiful swirl. Very nice. Very happy with this soap. I'm not sure, sure that I like the jojoba beads on top and that's probably just because I got a few little clumps that can all be fixed with a better distribution of them that's pretty that's my top this is an all out girly soap I just love pretty soap and when I seen everybody using those fondant mats I was like I've got to try that and I'm so glad that I did but y'all need to clean them up but very very happy Who couldn't be happy with a soap like that, right? And the colors are just beautiful. See, close up. At least now I know it works and it did not seep under which I tried to get it cut perfectly to the size of my mold and I was so afraid I was gonna ruin it because that mat was $20 and I was afraid I was gonna ruin it but I didn't I got it so pretty close hoping I've got these in the frame I've not been watching and these I'm thinking I've gotten off on yeah I'm gonna have to cut a smidgen off of here which is fine be a sample because mm -mm. I was getting out of line when you have embeds on top you kind of gotta that's why I don't like a multi cutter because you don't never know if you need to adjust it or if you've got them on there perfectly and if you've not you've got a multi cutter then you just cut into your embeds on top and that's no fun I really like the swirl on this soap. It turned out really pretty. Of course, it smells awesome. Who doesn't like strawberries, you know? Mm. Cutting it close on those. not be more happier right now with a soap I 
There's my bottom again. Of course, you know, it goes up the sides. And this one, let me weigh it and see how much it weighs. So I'm not sure. I might have to cut off a smidgen. I'm not sure. Yes, I need to cut off a smidgen. It's almost seven ounces. I didn't think it was that big. But I guess it is. Okay. That's a skinny piece. Let's weigh it now. Well, look at there. 5.6. Perfect. So there's that piece. Alrighty everybody, that is my new strawberry shortcake that I cannot be more happy with and I'm probably, I don't know if I should wait. I'm going to wait and see if I can't get the making video uploaded first before I get this video uploaded. So um, right now it's 9.30 and I'm going to try to get this uploaded as soon as I can. Thank you guys for watching.